says, helping with seven for five, so boxing three turn rounds. Welcoming and introducing, making his seven for five, so boxing debut to the blue club. And here comes Johnny Hale fighting out of the number one gym in Irvine. Heavyweight action now. This is land of the giant stuff. Johnny stands at six feet three. An orthodox fighter trained by Joe Fleck. Wearing black and gold trunks. And Johnny has met with an enthusiastic crowd reception, to say the least. Making his way now, Ian Gibson coming to the ring. Ian stands at six feet, 33 years of age. And Ian was also victorious in his last outing on Wild Card Promotions, his road to glory. are definitely in the yard now as Gibson and Hale both come to the centre of the ring referee Stuart Allen giving the instructions these are two guys that can really throw punches I have personally seen Hale in sparring and have witnessed Gibson fighting before here we go Hale right away now trying to establish a bit of dominance Gibson starting to throw wildly both men trying to control the centre of the ring Gibson tags Hale with a good right hand and having repeated success with it. Hale now starting to settle a little bit, starting to measure. Gibson now backing Hale up with the jab. 
good forward attacking movements by Gibson and now Hale responds with a good counter left hand Gibson ties up and a good left jab there by Hale again solid punches Gibson now starting to visibly mark Again, good jabs by both men connecting simultaneously. And the crowd is lapping up this action. Everyone on their feet, everyone cheering. Dramatic stuff here in the main event. And Hale now continually connecting with Gibson, using his reach well. Gibson trying to get inside. Gibson visibly marked also. Oh, a solid right hook there by Johnny Hale. Gibson can't keep taking much more of this punishment. Gibson looks hot as Hale piles forward at the end, towards the end of round one. And a good right counter there by Ian Gibson. And end of round one now. Crowd on their feet chanting. Two men both marked after a bruising, pulverising first round. What was getting thrown in that round were big punches, powerful, strong punches, whether it be jabs, hooks. Both men throwing with bad intentions, both men planting their feet and both men doing the damage. It's a question now of who is going to cave first. And it looks as if Hale is unable to continue. And it's a bad cut above Hale's eye. Hardly surprising there that the doctor brought the contest to an end. Hale in no condition to continue. That was violent ring carnage. Two minutes of swing from the fences action, damaging punches. Gibson being proclaimed the winner. That was heavyweight boxing at its bruising, pulverizing best. It's a wonderful match between Irvin Businessman and Russell Brolin with TV Michael McElroy and his stronger against Tommy, the Dalton Square, the People's Champion, Sheridan.